is Jody Lester, or JL, and you are on Elevated Living at ElevateMe.org, and this is The Daily Lift. We are ending our February 2011 discussion on relationships, and we're going to have a special discussion on some spiritual aspects of relationships on Sunday. But until then, this is primarily the last of our relationship series. And as such, I think we need to discuss a little bit about learning from love. Relationships, whether they last forever or only for a short time, are just like any experience in life. They're there to teach us. There is a saying that some of my mentors and business partners and friends have. Does it make you bitter or does it make you better? Well, that can be a topic in and of itself. But we definitely need to make sure that in all of our ways and all that we do, that we are learning from love. Love is a teacher. It is wise and powerful. And we need to be reverent to the lessons that it is giving us. Let us not take anger and baggage into the day-to-day -day life. Let us not move from one relationship to another with unresolved issues and broken promises and pieces, with damage and poor, low expectations. Let us learn from love. Take what's useful, meaningful, and beautiful, and leave the rest. It's no longer necessary. Let's learn from all of the things around us that our relationship brought. Let's learn from the people who we met during that time, some of which we will leave behind, others that we will carry on into different ways of how we relate to people who were connected to our past. In all that we learn from our relationships, let it be good. So many of us are so broken and we take all of that shattered and pointed and jagged piece of rock and dust and dirt and glass and everything else that can be used as a weapon. And unfortunately, we sometimes hurl it at the next unsuspecting person who is the object of our affection. So leave all that ragged garbage right where it belongs in the trash and take only the very best from one relationship to the next. That's only if, of course, you happen to have a relationship that does expire. Now, if you're one of the lucky ones who has found the forever, well, good for you. Continue to grow, continue to learn, and continue to teach us and others how to love for a lifetime. This is very short, but definitely join me on Sunday for a deeper elevation on ladies submitting and men honoring. I look forward to seeing you. But until then, this is Jody Luster, or JL, and you are on Elevated Living at elevateme.org. And until we next connect, let's continue to grow and learn about love, ourselves, and most of all, each other, while living the very best of life. Ciao.